FINA, the Oromo Pathway to Comprehensive Growth. A Holistic Vision of FINA Imagine a world where progress is measured not just by economic indicators but by the well-being of people and the planet. A world where the health of our communities and the environment is prioritized alongside economic growth. This is the essence of FINA, an Oromo concept that offers a refreshing and insightful perspective on development. FINA urges us to look beyond material wealth and technological advancement, considering the deeper impacts on society and nature. It is about nurturing the soul of a community and ensuring that progress benefits everyone, embodying a journey of growth that encompasses social, cultural, spiritual, and moral dimensions. The term FINA in the Oromo language broadly translates to development, progress, or growth. However, its meaning extends beyond conventional definitions. FINA can be seen as a multifaceted concept that encompasses elements of a philosophy, an approach, and a path. 1. Philosophy At its core, FINA is a philosophy that reflects the Oromo worldview, emphasizing a balance between material and spiritual well-being, social justice, and respect for nature. It provides a foundational ethical framework rooted in Gada and Oromo Safu principles. 2. Approach FINA also serves as an approach to development, offering guidelines on how communities and individuals should grow in a way that is sustainable and harmonious. It encourages a developmental process that integrates cultural values, communal responsibilities, and environmental stewardship. 3. Path Additionally, FINA can be considered a path that outlines the stages or phases through which development unfolds. As we will explore later in this video, the seven phases of FINA represent steps on a journey toward holistic growth and prosperity. Overall, FINA combines these elements into a cohesive framework that guides both personal and communal development, making it simultaneously a concept, approach, path, and philosophy. FINA signifies a continuous process of betterment that is holistic, inclusive, and sustainable. FINA recognizes the interconnectedness of all aspects of life and emphasizes the importance of balance and harmony. It teaches that our actions have far-reaching consequences and we must strive to maintain equilibrium in all we do. The Core of FINA The Oromo people, indigenous to the Horn of Africa, have lived by the principles of FINA for generations, with their culture testifying to its enduring wisdom. Their way of life shows us the power of living in harmony with nature and each other. FINA invites us to rethink our definition of development and embrace a more holistic and sustainable path for the future. It challenges us to create a world where everyone can thrive, and where progress is measured by the well-being of all. The Deep Roots of FINA FINA is deeply rooted in the rich cultural heritage of the Oromo people, particularly their traditional Gada system and the ethical code of Safu. The Gada system, a democratic socio-political structure, provides the framework for societal organization and governance. It emphasizes collective leadership, consensus building, and the cyclical transfer of power, ensuring stability and continuity. Safu, meaning respect or ethical conduct, acts as the moral compass guiding individual and collective behavior. It encompasses principles of honesty, integrity, compassion, and respect for nature. Together, Gada and Safu form the bedrock of Finna, providing a strong foundation for sustainable and inclusive development. Key Aspects of Finna 1. Holistic Progress FINA is not limited to economic growth or material wealth. It includes the development of knowledge, skills, moral values, social relations, and spiritual well-being. It ensures that all aspects of life are in balance and that progress in one area does not come at the expense of another. 2. Cultural and Ethical Foundations The Gada system, which is the traditional socio-political system of the Oromo, provides the structural framework for FINA, Safu, the ethical code of the Oromo, ensures that development is pursued in a manner that is respectful, just, and harmonious with the natural and social environment. 3. Collective and Individual Progress While FINA emphasizes individual growth and self-improvement, 
It is equally concerned with communal progress. The development of an individual is intrinsically linked to the development of the community. Finna promotes the idea that the well-being of the community is the foundation for individual success and vice versa. 4. Sustainability and Continuity The concept of Finna is inherently sustainable. It is a process that seeks to create long-term, enduring improvements that can be passed down through generations. This aspect of Finna is closely linked to the Gada system, which operates on an eight-year cycle and emphasizes continuity, preservation of tradition, and the transmission of knowledge and values across generations. Finna, development of the whole person. Finna redefines the conventional, often limited understanding of development. It transcends mere economic metrics, acknowledging that true progress involves all facets of human life and our connection with the natural world. Finna highlights the significance of cultural preservation, social harmony, environmental stewardship, and spiritual growth. It understands that material wealth without moral grounding or social cohesion is empty and unsustainable. The Seven Phases of Finna The Oromo perceived development as a journey through seven distinct phases, each symbolizing a specific stage of growth and progress. 1. Gudina, Growth The initial phase focuses on the fundamental growth of individuals and communities. Gudina signifies an enhancement in life through new experiences, including physical development, learning, and the establishment of social and cultural foundations. 2. Gabina, Expansion and Enrichment In this phase, the growth achieved in the Gudina phase is expanded. It involves broadening one's capabilities, acquiring new skills, and expanding social networks. This phase also includes the accumulation of resources and wealth, ensuring a stable foundation for further development. 3. Balina, Broadening The Balina phase is about broadening horizons, both intellectually and socially. It includes expanding one's understanding of the world, embracing diversity, and fostering inclusive relationships. This phase encourages the enrichment of cultural life and the deepening of social bonds. 4. Badadina, Prosperity This phase emphasizes the achievement of prosperity in its fullest sense. It is not just about material wealth but also includes the well-being of individuals and communities. Badadina involves creating a balanced life where economic stability, social harmony, and cultural richness coexist. 5. Hormata Increase Hormata focuses on the increase and multiplication of resources, knowledge, and influence. This phase is characterized by strategic growth and the accumulation of assets that ensure sustained progress. It is about building on the achievements of the previous phases to create a more prosperous and empowered community. 6. Dagagina Development The Dagagina phase is about comprehensive development in all spheres of life. It involves advancements in education, health, infrastructure, and governance. This phase ensures that the benefits of development are widely distributed and that all members of the community have access to the opportunities created by previous phases. 7. Daga Hara, Innovation The final phase is characterized by innovation and creativity. It encourages the development of new ideas, the adoption of new technologies, and the pursuit of innovative solutions to challenges. Dagahora ensures that development is dynamic and adaptable to changing circumstances, allowing the community to remain resilient and forward-looking. Gada as the guiding framework of Finna The Gada system plays a pivotal role in guiding and structuring the journey of Finna. It provides a framework for collective decision-making, ensuring that development is participatory and inclusive. Within the Gada system, every eight years, a new generation assumes leadership roles, bringing fresh perspectives and ensuring intergenerational equity. 
This system of cyclical leadership fosters a sense of shared responsibility for the well-being of the community and the environment. Gada ensures that development is not driven by individual ambition, but by a collective vision for the common good. It is a testament to the power of democratic principles and collective wisdom in shaping a sustainable and equitable future. Safu, the Moral Compass of Finna Safu, the Oromo Ethical Code, acts as the moral compass guiding the journey of Finna. It ensures that development is not pursued at the expense of ethical values or the well-being of others. Safu emphasizes respect for elders, care for children, compassion for the less fortunate, and a deep reverence for nature. It promotes honesty, integrity, and accountability in all aspects of life. Safu reminds us that true progress is not just about material advancement, but about cultivating a just and compassionate society where everyone can thrive. It is a call to ethical leadership, responsible stewardship, and a deep respect for the interconnectedness of all life. Sustainability, the heart of Finna. Sustainability lies at the core of Finna, influencing every facet of daily life and community growth. The Oromo people who have lived in close harmony with nature for centuries have always recognized the importance of preserving their environment. They know that genuine progress cannot come at the cost of the environment, and this wisdom is handed down through generations. Finna stresses the responsible use of natural resources, advocating for methods that neither deplete nor harm the ecosystem. It encourages practices that are in harmony with nature such as agroforestry, water conservation, and the use of traditional farming techniques. Finna reminds us that we are part of nature, not separate from it, and that our actions have a direct impact on the environment. Our well-being is intricately linked to the health of our planet, and maintaining this balance is crucial for our survival. It is a call for ecological awareness and a commitment to sustainable practices in all aspects of life, ensuring a harmonious coexistence with nature. FINA a model for inclusive progress. As we transition from the traditional roots of Finna to its modern applications, we see how this ancient wisdom finds relevance in today's world. Finna, with its holistic vision, ethical grounding, and emphasis on sustainability, offers a compelling model for inclusive progress in the 21st century. As the world grapples with challenges such as climate change, social inequality, and economic disparity, Finna reminds us that true development must be multifaceted and address the root causes of these issues. It challenges us to move beyond narrow definitions of progress and to embrace a more holistic and sustainable path. Finna encourages us to prioritize the well-being of people and the planet, to embrace ethical leadership, and to work together to create a more just, equitable, and sustainable world. Finna is a powerful reminder that progress is not just about achieving economic growth, but about improving the quality of life for all members of society. It calls for a more inclusive approach to development that recognizes the interconnectedness of all aspects of life and the importance of balance and harmony. It urges us to think beyond short-term gains and consider the long-term impacts of our actions on future generations and the environment. Finna offers a blueprint for a more sustainable and equitable future where everyone can thrive. By integrating Finna's principles into modern practices, we can address today's pressing global issues with wisdom that has stood the test of time. In doing so, we pave the way for a future that is not only prosperous but also just and sustainable for all. Integrating Finna into Modern Education Systems Integrating Finna into modern education systems is a transformative step towards creating a more balanced and holistic approach to learning. Education is a key pillar of Finna, as it provides individuals with the knowledge, skills, and values they need to contribute to the holistic development of their communities. In the Oromo context, Education has always been a community-centered activity, focusing on imparting not just academic knowledge, but also cultural values, ethical principles, and practical skills. Traditional Oromo education emphasizes the importance of learning from elders, nature, and the community. 
creating a well-rounded individual who can contribute to the common good. By incorporating the principles of FINA into modern education systems, we can nurture well-rounded individuals who are not only academically proficient, but also socially and morally responsible. FINA encourages the inclusion of diverse perspectives, fostering critical thinking, creativity, and a deep sense of social and environmental responsibility. This holistic approach to education calls for the integration of traditional knowledge, cultural heritage, and ethical teachings into the curriculum. It values the development of the whole person, preparing individuals to be responsible citizens who contribute to the well-being of their communities and the world. By embracing FINA's principles, education systems can cultivate a generation that is equipped to tackle the complex challenges of the 21st century with wisdom, empathy, and a commitment to sustainability. A Blueprint for Sustainable Development As the world faces the pressing challenges of the 21st century, there is a growing need for new models of development that prioritize sustainability, inclusivity, and ethics. FINA offers a compelling framework that can inform global policy and governance, providing a blueprint for addressing complex issues such as climate change, social inequality, and cultural preservation. FINA encourages the adoption of policies that prioritize the well-being of people and the planet, ensuring that progress is measured by more than just economic growth. It advocates for a more balanced approach to development, where the needs of the environment, society, and the economy are considered equally. By integrating the principles of FINA into global policy and governance, we can create a more just and sustainable world, where development is truly inclusive and benefits all members of society. Inspiring a more just and sustainable future. FINA is more than just a development framework. It is a way of life that has guided the Oromo people for generations. Its emphasis on holistic progress, ethical leadership, and sustainability offers valuable lessons for the modern world. As we face the challenges of the 21st century, the principles of FINA provide a roadmap for building a future that is just equitable, and sustainable. The enduring legacy of FINA lies in its ability to inspire individuals and communities to think beyond material wealth and technological advancement, to consider the deeper impacts of development on society and nature. By embracing FINA, we can create a world where progress is measured not just by economic indicators, but by the well-being of all living beings and the health of our planet. As we look to the future, the principles of FINA offer a guiding light, illuminating the path toward a more harmonious and balanced world. Thank you for joining us on this journey through FINA, the Oromo Pathway to Comprehensive Growth. A presentation produced and presented by Burmadu Media. Subscribe, follow, join, like, and share Burmadu's videos. Copyright 2024, Burmadu Media.